Firstly, Andrew, um, how pleased are you that the club's immediate future has been secured? Oh, I'm absolutely over the moon. I'm uh, over the moon for ourselves for, for obtaining it, uh, but also for the club and for the fans they've got. They just don't have to worry about that side of it anymore. The stability of the club's here now. We just have a job to work and, and move it forward. We're relieved and we're very happy. It's been a, a, a bumpy ride over the past uh, few months. It's been very tough. Uh, when your assets are being sold, and by assets I mean players, and at long last now we've arrived at a solution and we can look at things in a positive manner. And I said after the Millennium game we'd be a better team in round 27 than we were in round one, and I stand by that. We'll, we'll get further personnel in and we'll improve as a group, and part of that improvement as a group will be because we've got off-field stability and that will lead to on-field stability. I mean, hands, have your hands been tied over these past couple of days? It's not about hands being tied or anything like that. What's happened's happened. There's a line drawn in the sand now and we go forward and we go forward in a very positive manner, in a very excited manner and in a way that it's like starting the season again. You know, it's, it's restart time, we can get those butterflies in the stomach and we can really get excited and enjoy what we're doing. And you could sense that today. The players train great today. It's the best they've trained for six weeks. And I think it might have something to do with the off-field news that they've been so positive and buoyant and upbeat on the field as well. Has John got licence to go out and, and buy some players bring, and boost that squad now? Oh, absolutely, yeah, absolutely. We've uh, Not only that, we've got um, a couple of quads players have, have left, which has got a couple of spaces for them to come in as well. Um, so, yeah, absolutely. We're going to have a good, really good squad. John, just talking to you now, it seems like you've got a weight lifted from your shoulders. I mean, it was different when I spoke to you before the season started. Yeah, it's, it is. There's, it's not only my shoulders, it's, it's everybody's shoulders, I think, at the club, and it's a, it's all the players' shoulders as well, and uh, yeah, it feels real good at the minute. Absolutely. John says that his hair's going to start going back again now. <laughs> <laughs> well, we've already got four players in, yeah, sort of immediately, so, uh, you know, we, we teed them up, hoping this would come off. It has come off. So the reality is there, and we've been able to bring four players in, two players on loan, Kyla Moore from Leeds, Craig Harvey from Warrington, and two players permanently have joined us, Josh Griffin and, uh, and, and Greg Johnson, who have both been released by Huddersfield. So really pleased with those four people. They won't be able to play over in France because of the logistics of the operation of getting the, the team over there, but they'll certainly put some pressure on the players who have already got the Wakefield shirt. So competition for places is becoming a reality once again. <laughs>